Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be talking about the use of cannabis, hemp, and stevia um, in our skincare products. So, uh, I have a couple things that I got some samples of that I wanted to test out together. Um, and I've been using these for a couple days, so I haven't really gotten the full effect of the product. But I noticed some things the first time I used it, so I want to kind of show you guys what they are. So the first one is this Mild Foam Cleanser. It is through the Vegan Glow brand. Um, and so this is how the little tube looks. This is a, like I said, this is a sample size, so it's very small. It's only one fluid ounces, but you don't need that much. And I've been using it a couple days, like I said. So the product itself, the full size 3.4 fluid ounce um, bottle is $16 on their website. And I'll link all this stuff in the description box. So with this one, it says that possibly the most effective, safest, and mildest foam cleanser ever made. A true simplistic formulation with natural key ingredients, no fragrance, and a pH level of 5.5. So, um, I'm going to test this out. And well, I'm going to show you guys how it kind of foams on camera. Um, my hands are already washed. So, I'm going to get my hands a little bit wet and apply it. I'm going to let you guys see how it looks um in my hand so it's kind of like a clear a clear consistency not too thick but not thin so i'm just gonna kind of foam this up and wash my face with just my fingers and my hands um it definitely is very mild there's really no smell you know y'all know i'm always smelling things when i put them on there's like no scent um so if you have sensitive skin this probably will work good for good with you. Uh, I have very oily skin, so it doesn't affect my skin um, either way. <laughs> but it doesn't have really any smell. I mean, it kind of smell. I mean, the smell that you do get up from it is kind of reminds me of like uh, I don't know, just like cl like clean or some medication or something. So I'm gonna rinse this off. So now that my face is clean, I'm gonna pat it dry with a um, clean paper towel. The next thing I'm going to um, show you guys is this new face toner I uh, bought. And I picked it up from Walgreens. You probably can find it at Walgreens, Target, um, Walmart maybe, I don't know. Um, but I found it at Walgreens and it was, I think $10.99, but let me check the check my receipts, hold on. Yes, yeah, $10.99, and it is the Shea Moisture brand. Um, it's the cannabis stevia hemp seed oil and with witch hazel and with vitamin C. It's actually the skin rescue, rescue toner. And this is how the container looks. So, this one says... I want to read off the website. Okay, so... It's basically supposed to help reduce um, or de-stress your skin and nourish it without like stripping your skin. Because sometimes some toners feel like you, because it is getting kind of the rest of the dirt off that you may not have gotten from washing your face, it makes your skin feel super dry. But this one doesn't. So far, when I've been I've been using it, and it doesn't. I like the fact that it's just like a little spray. But I like to put it on a cotton swab just because the way it's it mist is kind of thick. So I'd rather spray it on a cotton swab and then kind of just um you know dab it on dab it on in now. And I noticed when I use this toner, my skin feels like tight afterwards. Uh kind of like uh I don't know, I can't describe it like taut. Like, you know, you can hold your skin taut to do something to maybe, like, get wax or something like that. That's how I feel. It feels like my skin is, like, super tight when I finish. And I put toner on my eyelids, y'all. My eyelids get oily, okay? Mind y'all business. Um, so, I even put it on, on my eyelids because it, mm, child, I don't know. They just be full of grease, child. Okay, so that's that. Now let that dry. And it doesn't take too long to dry, but I kind of like all my stuff to kind of like sit a little bit. So while that's drying, I'm going to tell you about the next thing. The next thing is a serum. So the next thing 
that actually does have cannabis in it is the is this botanical reboot serum with cannabis and stevia so this is only five milliliters but and i see why it's only that <laughs> because online the one fluid ounce this is like point 16 fluid ounces the one fluid ounce is 30 dollars on amazon and this is a little bitty container the brand is um aretha i guess i don't know i'll put it in the description box at the bottom but this is how the container looks it's really small so yeah 30 dollars for one fluid ounces but i guess you know when you want to look beautiful it costs it costs so Cannabis stevia seed oil helps to nourish and maintain skin barrier function. It also has hyaluronic acid in it that helps like plump your skin and smooth it out. And then it has um, uh, niacinamide, uh, vitamin B3 that helps to even skin tone and texture. Niacinamide, That's, I said that wrong. <laughs> it also has niacinamide, which is B3. So that helps like even your skin tone and your texture, which I have textured skin and uneven skin tone. So. What this one says to do is for you to have put a couple pumps on your fingertips uh -oh. and you want to press it into your skin so i like to do that and it's kind of like a clear jelly uh, texture oh too far down and so i like to rub it into my fingers and then i put it on on the pertinent areas the important parts. So I like to press this in, kind of slap your skin and wake it up. Get that blood flow. Now this, when you get done using this, your skin is gonna it's gonna start feeling kind of sticky. Um, after it dries, no, it doesn't. But immediately as you're putting it on, you're gonna feel kind of like a kind of sticky-ish, kind of like. It's almost like you can hear it, hear the stickiness on your face. Y'all you know I mean? hear that? I don't know. I don't know if that means something or if it's the product or if it's because it's a serum and not like a cream or a lotion. But once you, once it dries and, you know, you move on to the next step, you don't, it doesn't feel, it doesn't feel like this after you after you finish so it kind of just makes you like your skin just feels like squeaky clean you know what i mean that's how that's the feel i get from using this serum after i use that serum so that's that that's step number three so we cleanse we tone we uh serum our skin up now the last thing i have right here is the avant brand and it is a moisturizer but it is Let's see. I'll tell you how much it is. <sighs> okay, so this also has hyaluronic acid in it too, vitamin C, um, jojoba, and avocado. And it is it says it's a supreme hyaluronic acid antioxidizing duo moisturizer. So this is how it looks. This is the brand Avant. And this is only 0.34 fluid ounces, 10 milliliters. It's also cruelty free. It's also cruelty free and paraben free. However, this is one hundred and twenty five dollars <laughs> online. Okay, on Avant Skin Care's web page, it is one hundred and twenty five dollars. Now, I will. I'm trying to clear my skin, and I'm trying to do all the things, all the things. Okay, however. I'm not gonna do it. So we're gonna use this little sample and we're gonna use it sparingly until it's gone and I ain't gonna never buy it again. Okay. I refuse. I refuse to spend $125 on one moisturizer. This didn't that didn't have been a whole product line. But it does have a, a somewhat of a smell. It smells very clean. It's a green kind of co uh, color when you pull, uh, pour, not pour it out, but when you squeeze it out of the tube, it does come out green. Um, so just be aware it's not going to be white. And I like to uh, 
spread my moisturizer in like this as if I was using my roller. Um, just so that I can massage my face. Mm -hmm. Massage it on me, child. Get that neck. You don't want to have no dry neck. Okay? Don't want to have no dry neck now. If you, if you tired, if your face is tired, at least. If you don't want to buy this and you want to pay $30 for this on Amazon, get this. Because it's going to make your skin feel super tight, super like, you know what I'm saying? It's going to make you feel like. So, that will be good for someone who's who's been maybe working a lot, tired. Last thing but not least is... I'm going to go on with a little bit of a little something, something on the lamp, okay? This is just some lip balm from a previous skincare line I had. They sent the, they sent with the product, which is the, the Butter Bar Shea Butter Lip Balm. It also has vitamin C in it. No, no um, hemp, no stevia, no cannabis, but, you know, you don't want to be walking around with a fresh face and crusty lips. So that's that on that. All right, you guys. Have y'all? If y'all ever use any, do y'all have any like hemp oil? I heard somebody tell me I should use like a hemp oil or CBD oil on my face. It is very calming. This skin, this stuff is very calming. I'll tell you that for sure right now. Like even when I use this in my other regular routine, I was like, oh, I just feel so relaxed. Like, eh, calm. I feel calm. Okay, so that's all for these things. I will link the websites for each product in the description box if you have ever used this these any of these brands let me know if you have ever seen them if you have tried them what other products that these brands have that you do like or maybe you don't like um and if you have if, have had any good experiences with what do you want to call cannabis or stevia on your face what are your stories and I will see y'all in my next one. Peace, gang gang.